Hi, I'm Charlotte, and I'm here to talk about artificial intelligence. Have you heard of recommender systems? Recommender systems are AI computer algorithms that track your habits, your likes and dislikes, your beliefs, how much money you have, and where you are at any given time. These recommender systems help you to choose music and video that you would enjoy based on the things you've watched in the past, or people like you have watched in the past. The ads that you see on the internet, in social media, and on apps, if you've ever had that feeling like you thought about it and it appeared, it's probably because people like you have enjoyed those same types of things. Or maybe you've clicked on an email link and now it's recommending things that you would like. Recommender systems provide coupons for you and they know which products you're likely to buy, even if you've never purchased from that company before. Recommender systems are also used in sentencing and bail in the justice system so that judges know whether or not you're likely to reoffend. Insurance companies use recommender systems to know whether or not you're a risk and your credit may be influenced by these recommender systems that are used by companies. Even elections and the news you see can be influenced by recommender systems, which changes how people think about the world. These recommender systems are built by data aggregators, companies like Palantir, Datadog, and First Data, who are spending billions of dollars and earning billions more to take these tiny bits of data about you, every email you read, every web page you visit, every social media app that you use, the location data from your phone. When you watch or listen to anything on your television, these data aggregator companies bring all of that data together to build a very specific profile of people like you. We need to ensure that these data aggregation companies reduce bias, that they show appropriate content to adults and children, and that everyone knows how to protect themselves when they have data that they don't want to share that's personal. We need to make sure that data aggregation companies and recommender systems benefit all people. Mm -hmm.